Hello friends. Today I will be again talking about the gender issues. Gender issues are very important as we all know that there are lot of problems regarding equally treatment and equitably sharing the opportunities of the society among the genders. So what is equality and what is equity? Suppose there is cricket matches going on and lot of people are going there to watch the cricket tournament. Now suppose a parents and child has gone there. The parent father's height is suppose uh, almost six feet, the mother is five feet and child is just four feet. And there are a lot of stools are there around that who are lower height, they can use the tools to watch the game because there are fencing everywhere. And this fencing, you cannot watch directly the cricket there, all are barricaded. In this scenario, Suppose three persons, the organizers may think that all tools are on feet height, so on foot height, so they can um, uh, stand and they can see. But father, for father, there is no problem. For mother also, there is no problem. But for the child, son, it is a problem. The child, it has a problem. The child, the child even on foot, that stool, uh, he stands, he cannot see it. Then what should be done? Treatment is equally, all are given the same stool, all kind of same stool, but they are not equally able to see, but treatment is equally given. In this context, then father may decide, okay, I uh, will put two tools on uh, one, up, one over the other and the son can be, a child can be put on that, then child can see. So by this way, equitably, this is basically treated. By this way, equitable sharing of the opportunity. Now, in the third case, if the barricade is not there, organizers feel that this kind of lot of stools are not available, it is not possible to arrange. So, the organizers decide that, okay, we will not keep this barricade, we will keep it open. So, whoever have cut the ticket, they can come inside and they can see the game without this kind of harassment. So this is kind of kind of the problem of the uh, watching of the uh, the match is over. So by this way that uh, equitably all people all people it is open to everybody. So this kind of opportunity. So in case of gender also this happens in the society that the gender has some roles. So gender roles, gender norms and gender relations are very important. Now, uh, gender norms basically for girl and boy, there are different treatment in the society from the uh, growing up stage of the children. So parents sometimes that, that girl child is mostly neglected. They are told that you be in the house, you should work the household works and you should uh, help the mothers, this kind of and household issues. Mothers also told that they should be in the house, they should have the norm to be. This is called gender norm. In the society, completely the uh, female gender are always told that you should be in the house, you should take all decision in the house. That is gender norms. Now gender roles, gender roles basically changes. Gender roles are basically that in the total society, how the gender is behaving, that is important. Now, gender, every gender should, women should do that and in the society, how they are doing. Now, in the total scenario, how these gender relations are established in the bigger society. Suppose in the agricultural field, whether male people are working more or female people are working more. In the entire statistics says that in the entire world, the female population, they are engaged in the agricultural field and they generate almost more than 60% food in the whole world. But they are not equally treated because their norm is 
different to be in the house and also work in the field but in the city also this kind of opportunity needs to be extended to the the uh, both the genders equally the how it will be done then then this all restrictions the limitations should be all need to be uh, removed so that both the genders get the full opportunity to grow like a girl if it is told that you should play football you should play this kind of all kind of thing so they can grow also and they can sign in their life and both if it treated properly so sometimes in the developing country many places also the women are treated differently that women that sex that um, female sex is different very badly so they suffer a lot in the whole society so i will be talking about the lot of statistics later in the world health and health organization and different world united nations statistics these are showing that how the gender equality needs to be made and the whole this whole society can improve the so, swami vivekananda told that the, in india our both wings that male and female should work together so whole nation can also progress through that so female genders are with their the mother and also the most important thing that that most important power of this society is women folk so we need to give the equitable facilities to our national building so this gender issues always we should all keep in mind and we should try and strive that our society should improve through the equitable sharing of both the genders thank you very much i think lot of readings are there and we should always be aware and conscious about gender equality thank you very much for watching this video today